we can all learn and practice some simple rules of statistical thinking. Statistics are provisional. Findings can always be improved. We must be prepared to recognize the validity of figures available today, but ready to applaud rather than criticize when tomorrow there is better information available through which to revise them. Statistics are uncertain. We should be skeptical of those peddling impossible guarantees rather than demanding them and celebrate those who tell us about risk and imprecision. Statistics aim for impartiality. In a world of spin, where numbers are used to substantiate assertions rather than illuminate reality, we must be doggedly determined to root out bias and ask ourselves whether something is really what it seems. Statistics help us join the dots. We must be modest in jumping to conclusions about cause and effect, but appreciate the real value that comes from finding patterns that help us ask good questions. Everyone can do this, but not everyone can be a statistician. We need also to appreciate that those who are statisticians abide by principles of professionalism that should give confidence in what they say. We should look carefully at the provenance of statistical claims to see if they are coming from people or organisations that have signed up to the necessary standards of conduct and have the necessary degree of expertise. The principles of statistics have been captured in a variety of ways. The late Roger Jowell, who was a great mentor to me and an inspiration to many, was the leading light in the development of the International Statistical Institute's Code of Ethics. These requirements are echoed in other documents, for example, the fundamental principles of official statistics. And it's relevant to note that the origin of these fundamental principles was to help in redefining the role of official statistics in those countries in Central and Eastern Europe, Eastern Europe with new democracies. Adopted first in Europe, the policies were quickly recognized to have wider significance and in 1994 were adopted by the United Nations Statistical Commission, the highest statistical authority in the world. And closer to home, the Royal Statistical Society Code of Conduct commended to all fellows and mandatory on all professionally qualified fellows sets out principal duties in regard to the public interest, duty to employers and clients, duty to the profession and professional competence and integrity. The professional statistician offers users of statistics confidence in the provenance of and conclusions from the data.